Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to install and run pgadmin4 in a Docker container. First of all, we'll head to the pgadmin website. Select the documentation option from the menu and then the latest version that's listed. In the deployment section, we can find a page on container deployment. This page describes the PostgreSQL utilities that are included with the container, the environment variables that you can set to configure your installation, mapped files and directories that you can configure to allow access to files and configuration on the host machine, and it gives some examples that you can run. We're going to use the simple example here that will run a Docker container on port 80 on the local machine. First of all, we need to pull the container from Docker Hub. Now the container is downloaded, we can check that it's on the system with the docker images command. There it is. Now we can very simply run this command to launch the container. This will configure the default username as user at domain.com with a password of super secret. You can change these options however you wish. We can use the docker ps command to check that our container is running. There it is. So in our browser, we should now find that this container can be accessed via port 80, the default HTTP port. We can log in using the username and password that was set. There's pgadmin. We can add additional users using the users option on the menu here. And just to check that everything looks good, we'll make sure that the online help is working. And there we go, pgadmin4 up and running in a Docker container. Thank you.